gamers. And it dunks reviews his first hand recollections of a new western extravaganza brought to you by the boys at Rockstar. This is Red Dead Redemption. And I'm gonna tell you all about this crazy western story. What are you doing? No, you're not. Give me, give me that mic. What? Why can't I do the review? Because I shot you five minutes ago while you were supposed to play dead, remember? That's that's your job. Oh, oh yeah. I, I think you're right. Oh well. Uh, uh, get him! Alright. Okay, well then. <laughs> Okay gamers, once again it's Old School Fool from Dosh Reviews, and today's review is Rockstar's Red Dead Redemption. And boy has Rockstar redeemed this title. It's been almost six years since the last release of this western story. Though not a totally new concept, however this is something that works, and makes me intrigued to see some new flavor to this already free room world, you know, type genre that we have going on so, uh, you know, so vagrantly sometimes. Alright, so you take hold now of, of John Marston, a really banged up cowboy at the turn of the century in a pursuit for redemption. Now the story as it opens is very open ended and doesn't really give you much objective at all. Now, however, you'll, you'll notice very quickly that this is an intriguing story actually unfolds as you play. So it really makes you feel as if you're living a western instead of just like, kind of catching up on the story. Yes sir, right now? That sarcasm's most unbecoming, Eli. It's gonna hold you back in life, even worse than your lazy eye. Now, when it comes to making you feel like you're in the wild, wild west, I mean, it's all here. From horse riding etiquette, to like, the really beaten up looking frontiersmen, I mean, yeah, and these guys are ugly. Take a look. I mean, even the Wild West gunslinging sessions in Dead Eye mode is similar to the Max Payne style gameplay and to that, like, you know, good, bad, and ugly attitude that, you know, you're so familiar with from the old, you know, Western, Western stories that we're all used to. I mean, look at the attention to detail in this game. From gross teeth, on most of the people anyways, you know, because I guess there wasn't any toothpaste, you know, back then, and it totally wasn't an option, to tons of cliché cowboy references. This game has taken the ultimate free roam game a la GTA style and have turned it into a western masterpiece. I mean look, it even comes complimentary with your own pissing dogs. Now, how, how can you go wrong with that? <laughs> it's crazy. Now, the graphics are beautifully rendered vistas. To straight up ranch hidden, you know, hidden away trails. I mean, the sound is even stupendous, right down to the rhythmic horse hoof sounds. I mean, listen to this. If that wasn't enough, you even get that cool, like, that good, bad, and the ugly sound, like, ambient style music. I mean, it really adds to the flavor of this game. Not too shabby. Now, lots have been asking, well, how free roam is it? Well, at first, it's a bit linear during the opening sequences. You know, it kind of is like, okay, already. But you can go from being the good guy to being the bad guy and back again in seconds. The gameplay options are all here. I mean, you even have the, the ability to get your whistle on so your trusty steed can come a-running. I mean, when he's not nearby, you, you get a whistle. The voice acting is actually decent. It's actually decent enough to keep me entertained through the, uh, you know, the uh, elongated action, you know, sequences where the story is kind of loose-ended, but nonetheless, this is the Wild West, so anything can happen. You any further. Come on, Bonnie, we got things to do. Mr. Marston, do you want to join us? It's Daddy's favorite pastime. Apart from political discourse, that is. What is? Breaking in horses. Well, gamers, if this is a try or a buy, that's the question. I'm a huge fan of taking old engines and making them creative, to the point where it's just another, you know, not another reskinned, rehashed product. And honestly, Red Dead Redemption delivers, and it does just that. It gives me a reason to put my 10-gallon hat on, rustle up some beef jerky, and make my way across the West in search of redemption. Going to give this game, guys, a 90. It would have got a 95, but honestly, you know, come on, it's Rockstar. I don't want to give, you know, let it get to their heads, so you guys get a 90.
Uh, Mr. Mr. Old School? Do, do I have to still have to play dead here? Yes, you do. Uh, uh, okay. Tell me when it's over. <laughs> okay, dude. No problem. Alright, gamers. Don't forget. If you guys like our reviews and like our video game news and tech news on all the new cool products that come out in the gaming industry and, you know, just in the nerd industry, don't forget to check us at dosreviews.com. And don't forget to fan us on facebook.com. Yes, that's right. And don't forget to check out our sponsors, doscheap.com, for all the latest and greatest in video game products and tech products. All right, gamers. I'm Old School Fool. And once again, thanks for watching and see you guys next time.